morning, all the 225 members uh, attended the parliament to vote for this crucial presidential election in which uh, 134 of them voted for the acting president and a six-time prime minister, Ranil Vikramasinghe, and only uh, 82 uh, parliamentarians voted for the other, the SLP MP, uh, Dallas Alapa Peruma. So uh, it was a secret ballot and it's the, for the first time that Sri Lanka is uh, uh, has elected a president through a secret uh, ballot. Everything was uh, live broadcast and even here people were uh, watching every step uh, uh, of this election and um, uh, just after the election was concluded the counting began and results were uh, just after that announced and uh, uh, Ranil Vikramasinghe was declared the 10th president of this country. And Navadita, we can see from the, the pictures there behind you some, some people uh, chanting and applauding. Uh, just what's the mood been like in the city as this vote takes place? This is, of course, a victorious candidate that many protesters didn't actually want to see win. No, they all rejected Ranil Vikramasinghe. What you see behind me are the protesters already shouting, Ranil, go home. And that is what their sentiment is. They are very angry, very disappointed. They all blame uh, and accuse Ranil Singhe to be an ally of the Rajapaksas. And uh, for years, they, uh, they say that Ranil has protected this family from uh, corruption charges. And they say that they are not going to stop protesting. Even they are mobilizing to reinforce their a demonstration. They are going to meet here at 3 p.m. in a, in a few hours to start their protest again because at any cost they don't want Ranil Vikramasinghe as their leader. Okay.